breathe. Open your mouth for me, please. Ah. Uh, uh. I said, if you don't want, if you don't want to marry me, then why don't you just come out and say it? Pardon me. Can you watch what you're doing, sir? You watch this. Samuel. Daddy. Keep playing. What in the hell you doing here? You okay to walk? Walk. Take her with you. That man needs help. You ain't gonna be giving it to him. This one big favor. You understand? Master Samuel. You know what I need you to do? I have some idea, sir. This strictly between us. Me, Bell, your folks. This here ain't none of their business. I'll make it worth your while. Let me see him. What's his name? Eddie. I can't call him that. Kessler. Mr. Kessler, can you hear me? I am doing this. And then he What's that? It's just something he's been babbling. He fell lost in that toy. Give him some more whiskey. He's on the verge of alcohol poisoning already. Triumph. Triumph. Don't need okay. that. Get started. I'll need you both to hold him down. Hold him. Hold him. Mr. Chalky White. Should I keep going? If I don't stitch him up now, he won't last another five minutes. You can take your hand off now, unless you intend to asphyxiate him. Will he live? I'm just a student. Earliest night you knocked off this week. Where am I taking you? Home, Larry. Commissioner? It's me, Larry. We have that announcement this morning. I'm here to pick you up. Mr. Stanley! <laughs> Barrick! Hey, Barrick, come back here! You thought you can get away from me. <laughs> Sure, I picked them up in the morning sometimes. I took them to meetings. Once in a while, I drive them home. You ever drive them anywhere else? No, not really. You know, he lived a pretty simple life. After Colleen died, he pretty much been keeping to himself. Yeah, I understand that. After my husband passed, I kept to myself, too. Sometimes you get lonely. You need something to fill that void. I know I did. I did some things I wasn't too proud of. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, this is Trev. Trev may or may not be my boyfriend. You guys want to join us? 